This is a construction update for the week of July 29th by the City of Somerville and read by Kirk, a member of the Somerville Media Center. Improvement projects. Let's start with the Beacon Street reconstruction. Cyclists are advised to use the bike detour. Contractors plan to install a high friction surface on the southbound cycle track during the week of July 29th. The Somerville Bicycle Committee recommends this route to Inman Square and this route to Porter Square. Weather permitting, during the week of July 29th, Newport plans to place concrete for new sidewalks at the Washington Street intersection near Dali, as well as in front of the driveway at 65 Beacon Street. They're coordinating directly with residents there to schedule that work. The northbound raised cycle track is expected to be installed within the next few weeks. The track will run from Washington Street to Park Street and from Kent Street to Oxford Street. If you live within these sections of Beacon Street, access to your driveway may be temporarily restricted during cycle track installation. Abutters will be noticed, notified directly, but please make sure you're signed up for the city alerts to make sure you get the message. Please expect crews to work extended hours as needed, including weekday evenings and Saturdays from 8.30 a.m. into the afternoon. Next up, the Green Line extension. At the Broadway Bridge, installation of support of excavation structures for the new bridge continues. At the Washington Street overpass, the southern abutment is just about complete. Steel work is expected to begin in August. Drainage installation continues. Throughout the corridor, crews are installing drainage and constructing retaining walls and noise walls. For more details, see MassDOT's latest construction update. Next, the Sacramento Street underpass rehabilitation. The Sacramento Street underpass between Beacon Street and Somerville Ave below the MBTA Fitchburg commuter rail line is closed for repairs. It's expected to reopen by mid-October. Now the Somerville Ave utility and streetscape improvements. Work is progressing quickly and some modifications to the current traffic pattern in and around Union Square may be implemented in the coming weeks. Stay tuned to forthcoming editions of this newsletter as these logistics get sorted out. And if you live or work in the neighborhood, make sure you're enrolled in the city's alert system to be notified prior to major changes. During the week of July 29th, Barletta will continue installing the box culvert drainage infrastructure on the north side of Somerville Ave, approaching Stone Ave. Drainage work on south side of Somerville Ave is expected between Prospect Street and Medford Street. Next, Somerville High School building project. Demo on the facade of the E building. During the week of July 29th, demo will continue at the E building. If weather allows, contractors plan to pour concrete floor slabs for the first level of the western new building on or around Wednesday, July 31st. This work needs to be conducted in one continuous operation, so trucks have been granted permission to start early as 4 a.m. the day of the pour, and work may continue into the evening. The work itself is not loud, and contractors will make every effort to minimize truck noise during the early morning hours. Additionally, the morning of the pour, truck traffic will require School Street closed between Highland Ave and Medford Street, from 4 a.m. to 7 a.m. If you live near the high school, please ensure you're enrolled in the city's alert system to be notified before that work. And finally, please join us for the next public meeting about Central Mill parking on Thursday, August 15th at the Winter Hill Community School. Now the Washington Street water main upgrades. The water main will be cleaned and lined between Cambridge and Union Square. Contractors will continue installing temporary piping on Washington Street between Beacon Street and Hawking Street, which will provide water service when the existing main is decommissioned for upgrades. Some residents will experience interruptions to their water service during construction. Sign up for the city's alert system to ensure you're notified in advance. This project's approach will be similar to the recently completed work on Pearl Street. During the week week of July 29th, contractors plan to reconstruct sidewalks on Medford Street, which is between Partridge Ave to School Street. 
And finally, additional utility work. Utility companies are responsible for notifying residents prior to conducting any work, but we expect parking restrictions and lane shifts due to the following utility work. Detail officers may close a road if deemed necessary for safety. Eversource Gas. Cherry Street, Dearborn Road, Osgord Street, Laurel Terrace, Prescott Street, Spring Hill Terrace, National Grid, Washington Street. This has been a construction update for the week of July 29th by the City of Somerville and read by Kirk, a member of Somerville Media Center. For the latest, for the latest information, please visit somervillemass.gov slash detours. Thank <laughs> you.